what is up everyone it's gonna be my patch 14.12 a jungle tier list and i'm gonna go over everything you need to know on what's good what's bad and what's really terrible so for starters what is broken this rank tier list is for every rank but for high load specifically talia is the best jungler in the game in my opinion if you can play talia well which obviously junglers do not know how she's extremely strong i don't think she's broken low elo but i think talia jungle is an S tier super broken champion right now. And talking about Italia, AP junglers in general, very strong right now. Some of them got indirectly nerfed, like Karthus got nerfed, but he's still extremely strong. If you have an AD mid as an AP jungler, it's very good for you. And that's why Lilia is at the top of the tier list because she excels really fast with how good she is in the current meta. The other two top tier junglers, Kha'Zix. Personally, some people probably don't put Kha'Zix X plus tier, but I do believe Kha'Zix is super broken. After playing him with my R evolution or Q evolution, I think Ghostblade is super broken on him. I think Kha'Zix is extremely strong, but he also caters towards higher ELO. So if you're not, if you want a good broken low ELO pick, it would definitely tour. It would definitely be towards Volibear or Skarner. So these two champions, very good tank junglers that are really broken right now. Skarner got nerfed, but he's somehow still broken. So if you want something easy to play, Volibear would be my pick because Skarner is getting nerfed again and again and again. So I don't want you playing a champion that's going to be getting Giga nerfed. Also, Belveth, I didn't really touch on her, but Belveth is actually looking really strong. Kraken Slayer into Stridebreaker. This is looking really good. Honestly, I might start playing Belbeth because I think she's in a really good spot right now that she's performing really well. She does a really good thing for solo queue. So solo queue, it's all it's a lot of fighting. It's about being able to farm well and be able to fight on good timers. And Belbeth is able to farm while also being effective at these timers that you need to fight. So I think she's an extremely good jungler. Shaco, the one trick jungler, if I, I think Shaco's build the most stupid items ever. When they could just be building broken items and if they build lethality then shaco just obliterates you so i think shaco is just giga broken i don't like him and i really don't like people who play shaco in my games that is they could be good people outside of life but when they're in the game i just don't like them diego he's abusing kraken slayer too i think kraken slayer junglers are really good right now so the trio of kraken slayers is Belbeth, diego and kindred i think they're really good right now i think if you build this item it's extremely good for solo queue it's a good first item spike same with Viego. He's looking really good. I'm surprised he hasn't been nerfed yet. He should be getting nerfed, but I think pro play is making him more popular. So I think Viego is really good right now. And also I think Nilly, very good if you know how to play her. She's very overloaded right now. I think she needs nerfs, but he's a very strong AP jungler. Like we talked about, if you have an AD mid or if you just are really good at AP junglers, they're very good in this meta. So you can perform very well if you play them. Xin Zhao is my staple that I think he's just a solid pick. I think he's good into like everything really. S excels very well into a lot of range matchups. So I think Xin Zhao is just, you know, even Loriolos, he's a very strong, solid pick that you know, that tends to do really, really well. And a lot of these picks, I would say they're in between, you know, Emerald to high ELO picks. But if you want really broken lower ELO picks, I would say Amumu, Sejuani, and Ramus are the trio of Trinity that I think from like Iron to like, emerald are like god tier so if you want those champions is that something you want to pick up i think those are really good for lower ranks that are really good and solid that i think can be really performing really well for you a lot of these tier lists have b tier c tier i have a lot in b tier because i think b tier i think if you're not at like the top of the list it's really starts you start to kind of fade away and the jungle meta is really Easter Famine right now. If you're not clearing fast enough to keep up with the tempo, your champion is just not really that relevant. Nocturne, I actually think is really good. I think he's good low elo too, if you know how to play him. I think he's performing really well, but also it's a very fast game. So it turns into issues that you you generally start to fall apart in that regards. One thing we'll touch on again too is, first of all, Nefari. I tried him. Unfortunately, he still kind of sucks. He's okay, but he's playable. Much better than he was before, but I honestly didn't really, I might make a video about him, but I wouldn't say he's glaringly OP right now. Graves is getting buffed next patch for whatever reason. I think Graves is good. I don't think he's bad. Rai does plan on buffing him for some reason, but yeah, Graves not, you know, he might be a strong pick in the patch in the future, but right now he's just an okay, solid pick. Hecarim, I actually think is really strong. If you play Hecarim, if you like the full clear play style, Hecarim jungle is really strong right now. The Eclipse into Cleaver, into, you know, Zeke's Herald, I think it's really good. So I think Hecarim is in a really solid position right now with a good itemization build. Lastly, we'll touch on is Master Yi. Master Yi got nerfed again. 
after getting buffed. He went from bad, he went from OP to bad, to OP to bad again. They went too hard on him again. They shouldn't have touched his Q damage to monsters, but he might get buffed again because judging by the way Riot is, they'll probably just oh, buff him again. But he's not doing too well. I think his clear speed is too slow right now, and that's the problem when you're champion. Really needs to be fast. Like I said, clear speed is everything in this game right now. If you can clear fast, but also be strong in fights and like skirmishing and stuff like that, I think that's really broken. And I think that's where champions excel in this meta. So I hope you guys like this video. Be sure to like, subscribe if you haven't already. I'll be streaming around 7 p.m. PST. I'll be uploading more videos now too as well. So good luck on the game. Good luck on the climb. And good luck on everything.